thrilled to be here today to uh, uh, bring the heartland to the, to the Giuliani campaign. Uh, by the way, our Minnesota twins had a pretty tough year, too, so uh, <laughs> for, for all of us. David Ben-Gurion, first prime minister of Israel, once said, anybody who doesn't believe in miracles is not a realist. The revitalization of New York City was a miracle, but it was real. Uh, anyone, if in 1991 someone would have said that you could bring your family down to Times Square and feel comfortable, they would have said that would take a miracle. But what it took was leadership, and it was leadership that Rudy Giuliani provided. Uh, as a former mayor, and I, I've often said that I wish there were more uh, mayors in the Congress. Good thing we got some good governors in the Senate. Now we have an opportunity to have a mayor in the White House. Somebody who understands that it's about what you get done. It's not about the speech you give. It's not about the, the, the issue that you pontificate about. It's about what you do. In St. Paul, if it snowed, and the next morning I went to get a loaf of bread, and, and those trees weren't plowed, I heard about it. Right. Uh, that's the experience that, that Rudy Giuliani has. He understands, and I saw this as a mayor. We didn't raise taxes for eight years. Rudy cut taxes. Cities get revived. Uh, you make a commitment to do the best you can with your kids, quality education, it makes a difference. Uh, these are things that, that in the kind of day-to-day -day life of people that are important, and we also understand that, that the ideas for doing these things don't come from sitting at a desk in Washington. Having been a mayor, you understand that it, that, that it comes from listening to the people. Uh, this mayor has that experience. This mayor was tested. So many of us rightfully look at what Rudy did after 9-11 and the kind of leadership that he provided. But I will tell you that for me, having been a mayor, uh, having a mayor, by the way, a, a Republican man, a Democrat city, that in the end faced the challenges of, of, of creating more hope and more opportunity making sure that the streets were safe, making sure that we grew jobs by keeping lids on taxes, cutting bureaucracy. To do that in New York is, is a miracle. And Rudy did it. And I will sleep very s calmly at night with Rudy in the White House. One other perspective. I also serve in the United States Senate as the ranking member on the Near East Subcommittee. Uh, I understand, and by the way, my colleague, Senator Bond, one of the voices in the United States Senate, understanding the danger that, that we face with terrorism, the danger that we face with al-Qaeda, the danger that we face with Iran. I look at the folks on the other side of the aisle, and, and I'm getting the sense that, they, that their, their, their vision is if we're just nice at Ahmadinejad, he'll be nice at us. The world doesn't work that way. Rudy Giuliani brings a, brings a deep, visceral understanding of the, of, of the danger of terrorism, the destructive capacity of terrorism, and the need to have firm resolve in dealing with terrorism. That's the kind of leadership that America needs. That's the kind of leadership that, that Rudy has demonstrated, the understanding that he has demonstrated, and he's also demonstrated the capacity to, to make it happen, to, to get things done. So I am just thrilled to be with my friend. Uh, we started out together as mayors so over 14 years ago, 1993, both got elected, and I'm very proud to stand with him today, and I look forward to working with him when he gets elected president of the United States of America.